Well, happy Thursday, everyone. Things have calmed down quite a bit, especially compared to what we've seen yesterday and really over the beginning of the month. The rest of the month of January, it's looking calm, but it's also looking fairly dry and pretty cold. A chilly morning today. I expect another chilly night tonight into tomorrow and another one heading into the weekend itself. So very cold overnight temperatures, likely the coldest night of the year so far of the month so far, of course, as well, with areas of low clouds and freezing fog after midnight tonight into the morning hours. A lot of areas of freezing fog even out towards the coast. Now the beaches themselves still above freezing temperatures, but pretty chilly. It is January. That's not unusual. A few light showers are possible, though, as we head towards the weekend, especially out on the coast and further to the north. Douglas County, a better chance than Jackson and Josephine County. If you're south of the border into California or east of the Cascades, you're likely staying dry, mostly dry, cool and clear. That's the forecast well into next week and likely for the remainder of the month. February is a bit more of a question mark. Looks like we've got some rain on the way there, but that's way out in the future. Looking at the coast tonight, 30s for your lows, frosty conditions, 34, 35 degrees, fog, clouds early, then partly sunny by the afternoon. So big warm up by about 20 degrees or so back to the 50s in the afternoon. We'll mainly see the 40s in the afternoon in the West Valleys, clouds, some freezing fog in the morning, and then partly sunny as we head into the afternoon. Overnight, though, those cold 20s for your temperatures. And we're talking single digits in teens as we look east of the Cascades. Clear skies at night, mostly sunny skies during the day, about 36 your high temperature in Klamath Falls. Your your seven day forecast these big swings in temperatures. They're going to continue as we head through the weekend. Patchy freezing fog on Friday, Saturday, a slight chance of showers. That's going to be later in the day, so not much potential snowfall for lower elevations, not like what we saw on Wednesday. And if we see showers at all, Sunday mostly on the dry side of things, and then we'll continue with the dry trend, even warming things up by a few degrees by the middle of next week. For the basin, 30s and 40s over the next seven days. For your high temperatures, your lows mainly in the single digits and teens, maybe about 20 degrees or so Tuesday night into Wednesday, Northern California, 20s and 30s for your lows, mainly in the 40s for your highs, sunny skies just about every day and out on the coast. Plenty of sunshine next week, but until then there are a few chances of showers later Saturday into Sunday, especially.